Okay, I forgot that I had snow still active. Uh, there. Wait, did this? Um, okay. Just... Okay, I may... obviously I made some mistakes with that over there, but let me turn this on. I'll need to check that out for when we get back to Jedi Academy. Uh, anyway, so hi everyone and welcome aboard. I'll be your Captain Hillian today, along with... Yes, sir, Mike, Lieutenant Drakir, at your service. And welcome back to Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade. Specifically, it's called the Graphic Adventure Game because there were like three, four different kinds of this game. There was also the Action Game, which was on the Game, not the Game Boy, not the Game Cube. That would have been way too early. <clears throat> and yeah. Uh, let's see, last time we got started on the game and we quickly found out that I need a guide to get anywhere because, well, if left behind, if left, if with, uh, done without, we'd still be stuck in like the second area of the game. And Is this this one? No, th that would have been in Venice. Oh, uh, right. Yeah, if, if we'd gone without a guide, yeah, we would have been stuck in this place for at least two to three streams, I think, because it... It looks simple, but on the cover, it is rather complex. Uh, yeah. yeah. <clears throat> uh, last time we freed uh, Indy's father here. <laughs> totally not Sean Connery. And, but we were caught on the way out. But luckily enough, we had Indy's old diary, which looks just like the Grail diary. So we pawned that off to the asshole. And... Yeah, then we did the whole scene where they have to shovel around on the chairs and use the uh, <clears throat> the suit of armor to cut themselves free. And now we can make our escape. Now, here is where our, there's a split in the path according to the guide. <clears throat> if we had given the Grail Diary, we would need to... Uh, we, would, we would end up going to Berlin to get it back. But since we did not give it up, we're skipping that. So... Uh, oh. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, hmm? My food's done, I need to grab it. Okay. Uh, but yeah, yesterday I was not feeling up for streaming at all. So that is why, yeah, just no stream yesterday. Uh, let's just say that a mixture of uh, fatigue, not from sleep, but more uh, maybe from sleep, but just I was just fatigued and pained. For, uh, by stuff, physical stuff, which has uh, mostly passed. So, yeah, still ended up sleeping. I, 
I ended up taking a nap and slept for a lot longer than I wanted to. So that is why we are starting late and yeah, why we'll be going short with this. Probably yeah, I'm aiming for just two hours instead of the uh, four we typically do on Sunday. <clears throat> and back and well, a bit hard to do four hours from now since it would really almost crush with the Sunday yeah, feast dinner. Uh, on the uncles. Yeah. Yours. Getting that, we're going to Iskenderun. Okay. Now, here there apparently is another split that you can go into. And that all that depends on if we got that book, uh, one of the books from the library, specifically the manual here. It's, it's called How to Fly a Biplane. It, it, we actually get a look at it. Uh, turn on APU, switch L, pump oil, press your handle three times. Okay. At first, we'll actually need to get to a biplane because, well, we need to get, we need to try and get to that uh, city. Let's see. Oh dear. Uh, what is man? What is man? <laughs> <laughs> okay. A terrible pile of secrets. Or miserable little oh, right. pile of secrets. <laughs> oh dear. Let's see. Excuse me, sir. Yes, what do you want? I don't have all day, you know. Let's see. Let me turn on my fan here because I'm a little bit uh, uh a little bit heated still. Do you know what time the Zeppelin leaves? No. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, if we didn't have the manual here, there were two ways to get tickets for the Zeppelin. One would be to buy them for... Let's see, what does the guy say? Uh, let's see... Da -da 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 -da. Uh, that, that's the Ber Berlin part, we need the airport part. Okay, we can either buy them for 220 uh, marks. Do we even have that much? No, we do not. So the other way is to steal tickets off, well, the only other person that's around here. Hint, hint, Mr. Blue. Okay. Yourself? <laughs> May I help you? We'd like two tickets on the first flight out of Germany. Oh, okay, apparently that apparently the guide is wrong about that. Uh, still short. Yeah, still short. Okay, that's this two hen. Okay, now now we can switch between characters. Okay, then how do we steal this guy's tickets? There were there were tickets were visible as an interactable earlier. I'm guessing that's when he is looking away like that. Yeah, I think it is. Let's just make extra sure. Hmm. Okay, it didn't show up this time. Let me see. Stealing was real easy, and considering you may need your money to bribe slippery government officials later on, it's probably uh, best not to wait and to waste it now. Uh, uh, get to, okay, get one of them to talk about. Okay. Okay, I see. We need one of the Joneses to get at him talking, to distract him. Children? Yep. Oh no. And the other one needs to steal them. <laughs> now what? Uh, tell me about your grandchildren. How do we how we know about him having those? Uh, oh, uh, there we go. Yeah. Uh. Pick up tickets. <laughs> okay, he'll just stop waffling. You got what? Uh, um, <laughs> Indy. Yeah, just a fly. I caught a fly. A fly. You you caught a fly. Okay. Oh dear. And let's see, do I just move out to the exit here then? Come on, Dad. 
Okay, and there's the biplane that we can steal. Let's see. I'm going to put down a save here. Because apparently... <clears throat> and let's see. I'm just going to call this... Call this one split, not whatever that was. I'm going to put this down here because I want to try to get the biplane, even though the guide says that the arcade stuff part that follows it is pretty tough. <clears throat> but I still want to try it. it. Let's see. Okay, we can't interact with those. We can only really look to the biplane and probably off to the side to the Zeppelin. Okay, um... Now, do you really know how to fly this thing? <laughs> of course, Dad, just give me a moment. I feel like you said that in the uh, movie. I think so, yeah. Uh, let's see. Look, manual. Yeah. Okay, yep, I'm just going to take a, I'm just going to take a photo of this because I will not be able to re remember all of this in one go. I think I should remember something. I want you to told this on the stream before. Uh, at one point, me, I was at my father's place to be able to rent the newest uh, in a Jones movie through online. That's kind of new thing, or new and new, unless when the it was recently released to be digitally rented so we rented yeah. a Triscus to call for decent amount of uh, money was fair priced if it was okay there is all the other yeah. the movies were also be able to rent and uh, Temple of Doom was about for like 75 Swedish kroner but this one they wanted you to pay about 300 to rent this one. Okay. Oh, uh, uh, by latest, I mean the uh, Lost Crusade. And uh, this really confused me and my brothers and father. It just went, wait, what? Let's see. Fuse to tank with fuel in it. J. There. Okay, and it, okay, I, I can see at the top now that they people are starting to pay attention to us. Uh, turn on both Magnos, so B, Magnetos, push switch to far right, pull throttle out, E. Uh, yeah, okay, we have, okay, we have limited time on that, and we can only try it once. Okay, yep, <laughs> he's bolting straight for the Zeppelin. Okay, let's give that one more try. <laughs> that sound. That was close. What was close? And we just made it on board. I see. Tickets, please. May I have your tickets? Okay, offer item. Okay. Tickets. If we didn't have the tickets, we'd have to punch them out, probably, and just have to fight our way through this entire thing. And we saw how combat was last time. It gets tougher the further you get, uh, get with it. Okay. Yeah, like... This is a game where fighting should be your last resort. Yeah. When you can fight, just be bloody careful. Okay, let's try this one more time. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, there. One, two, three. Uh, there. There. Two of those. Uh, pull throttle out. There. Ignition, which is this one. And when 300, what? Press the ignition key, N. Where is N? Oh, there. Uh, okay, I think I messed it up. Uh, 
Yeah, I think I yeah, I think I messed that up. Okay. Hmm. Okay, one more try. If it fails again, we go to Zeppelin route. Okay. L one, two, three. Fuel pump, which is Q. Oh, no, that's um, there, there, then ignition, and once B hits three, this one is supposed to start moving now. Or did the, is the guide wrong here or something? Oh, you misclicked something. Yep. Let's see. APU. Three times. Fuel switch. Tank with fuel. Both of the magnets. Throttle. Okay, I see. escaping. Okay, I one more try. Be, otherwise, the guy. This this isn't even the guide being wrong. This would mean the book itself is wrong. Where? Oh, I see. I was wrong. One there. One, two, three. Fuel pump there. Both of those. Okay. There we go. But now... That should... Oh, wait. No. Oh, come on. What am I... Yeah, it stopped at three. Okay, so... Last time... Okay, APL is button L, which is the middle one of the first row. Uh, oil pressure three times. Fuel pump, which is the lowest right. Uh, tank with fuel, both magnets. Pull the throttle out. Ignition on. Wait, wait did I forget the... Okay, I think I might have forgotten the ignition uh, there. Okay, so L one two three. Uh, wait. Uh, Q that one. Uh, okay. There we go. Okay, oh. that, that would be an absolute nuisance to uh, try and remember. Also, let me put down another save. And yeah, here comes the arcade part. Okay, we can move around. Ooh. At these. Okay. And yeah, we need to shoot down uh, those. All right, Th these place have a um, second seat with the extra gunnery turret. Okay, okay let let's do the zeppelin part because yeah, you're supposed to. The more you shoot down, the further you can get with that. <laughs> okay. And yeah, according to the guide, you need to shoot down 20 of those fighters to actually get out of Germany. And the less you shoot down, the less distance you get, and the less uh, checkpoints you need to either fight your way past or bribe your way past. So yeah, Zeppelin it will be then. And the low oh. enchant, the limited stick. <clears throat>
Uh, let's see. Yo, sorry for missing most of the JKA stream. Got sucked into a work call that basically never ended. Well, you're lucky with that because the game basically broke down. It fro it kept freezing on the uh, Jedi Academy <clears throat> cutscene. Uh, so, yeah, we call it off early. And yeah, Tuesday, we're starting anew with it. With uh, the open JK version, which does get past that uh, point. And... Just for some reason, this. Just, for some reason, if I use the original EXE, it just gets stuck. <clears throat> but with OpenJK yeah. and such, it does not. Uh, 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 just mm. to be clear, yeah. it's not stuck in your normal sense. We can skip skip it. Yeah, but it just, just skip... it just freezes up. Yeah, <clears throat> probably. Is, but we could skip through it. It will mean we miss important story cutscene. Yeah. Also, I'm going. I need to step away for a bit because my throat just, for some reason, uh, completely dried up in like a few seconds. All right. Okay, and back. I, I typically have a mug standing here on my desk. <clears throat> Anyways, typically because I forget to bring them down. But yeah, it does make it useful for moments like this, huh? <clears throat> <laughs> let's see. Let's at least look. Let's at least see what happens from here on. But we will load over to the Zeppelin because I very much doubt that we can. Oh, Adat, get up. This is no time to take a nap. I very much doubt we'll be able to get past all the uh, checkpoints. Sorry, Junior. Come on, let's uh, go steal a car. And there's some very chatty ducks. It, it doesn't sound like quacks. Sound more like. Yeah, sound like more like farting or something. Yeah. Okay, we made ourselves a good distance with that. Really? Please tell about that expensive looking car. <clears throat> I need to see your authorization. Okay. And yeah, there's probably some way we could chat our way past this. Let me take a look here. At the biplane route. Uh, yeah, apparently there's... <laughs> Apparently there are seven roadblocks in total. And depending on how many of the fighter planes you shoot down, you pass by a set amount. But because we only shot down like two, we only skip one. So that'd be six of these to get past. Uh, oh. Let's see. Mm -hmm. okay, uh, okay, apparently even the... The guide rider has never managed to get past 19 plays and shot down. Oh. Uh, mm. Okay, if you shoot all the planes down, you will run out of gas and before the uh, and crash just before the final checkpoint anyways. There will be two cars and unfortunately the one with the Nazi plates will be out of gas. Uh, in joke, in Maniac Mansion, there was famously a chainsaw without any gas, and there was there f was therefore completely useless. <laughs> okay, it's a joke to Maniac Mansion. Uh, let's take the blue car and hit the road. You're now going to have to talk, bribe, and fight your way out of Germany through the <laughs> remaining roadblocks. Okay, let's try at least. Um, okay, there's another image here. They want. Let's at least try this way. But I very much doubt we'll be able to get all the way through. Yeah, and I mean, uh, hold on, I don't get. I'm sure that's not what happened in the movie. Hmm. Okay, this one we can bribe. Okay. Oh, yeah, we, we don't have enough money to bribe all the way. 
Okay, marks a few marks would be a poor substitute for a pass. But many marks? Okay, let me see how much I have. 15. Thank you, you may go, but don't let me see you again. Okay. It seems that we can talk our way past the others, except for one, so we'll have to try and fight there. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Halt. Need to see your authorization. Let's see. You 2111. Of course, how silly of me. Stop sniveling. I have the time to waste on one so. Yeah. <laughs> Limit the stick, sponge mops, sports and, and steps. Now, these are more heavy. Uh, of course, I'm sorry. You must be a, bu um, a busy, important man. Are you trying to flatter me? Yes. <laughs> Am I that obvious? You're gonna expect to make a fool of me. You're just too perspe uh, uh, perceptive. Oh, true. You may go. <laughs> he figured out we were <laughs> flattering him and still fell for it. Okay. Okay, three, three, two. Uh, hold it. You've got to come over here. He's a lot less secure on this. Assertive. Need to see your authorization. Three, three, two. My authorization, you insult me. I'm sorry, but I must ask. He talked his way to a senior officer. Uh, but how could I know? I mean, you're not in uniform. Soldier, let me pass immediately. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> okay, I'm kind of surprised that actually worked. <laughs> Okay, the, the real, the real uh, linchpin here is going to be if we could actually beat the one guard we can't flatter or bribe. Alt, leave your vehicle and step over here. Let's see. Need to see your authorization. Let's see. One, two, two, three, one. That is out of the question. No one passes without authorization. <laughs> Keep it down, this man with me is Gestapo. Gestapo? Him? Do we have proof? You have my word of honor, trust me. Okay, then three and one. Trust you, I could be shot for letting you pass. That is my final word? Or that is your final word? Well... I still can't let you by. Perhaps you'd better break it to him. Well, on second thought, you may go. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's... If I remember right, that was a thing. Even many Germans were afraid of them. Yeah. Because <clears throat> basically they, yeah, they could and would kill you for absolutely nothing. Please step out of that expensive looking car. Okay, the, the guide also identifies them by the color of their texts. I need to see your authorization. Okay, let me save because we need to fight this guy. Okay. And it looks like we can take this one. It's alternating and high. Face groin. <laughs> okay, was Hop expecting a tougher fight? Well, yeah, we can just bum rush this guy down, basically. There we go. <laughs> okay, that's my boy. And the last one has the longest chain out of these. 
Just one, then a bunch of twos, and one, and then again. Leave your vehicle and step over here. Bit odd that this part has music, but a lot rest of the rest does not of the game. Okay. That is out of the question. Someone must have gone through this hundreds of times to get these <laughs> correct uh, ones. Okay. Keep it down, that man with me is Gestapo. Okay. Gestapo Captain Clyde said nothing of this. You will need some proof. Okay. You have my word of honor, trust me. Okay. Trust you, I could be shot for letting you pass. You spurred my trust and insult. Insult or not, you must have clearance. Yeah, I'm actually keeping my thumb on the second monitor to keep track of which one I'm on here. <laughs> Soldier, do you, uh, do you realize you're out of uniform? Wait, what? Out of uniform, what do you mean? New orders have come <laughs> through concerning uniforms. I. Are you really going to bay with the bluff and new orders from where? If you want to argue, you know, if you want to argue with Captain Kleist, you can. Kleist 99. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, I'm honestly surprised all of that worked. <laughs> okay. Oh, dear. I did I did not expect any of <laughs> it's according to the map in your Grail diary, this is the place. Uh, we are like the heroes of the Arthurian legend. You are Galahad, the valiant knight. And I, his father Lancelot, who was turned away. Now is not the time for daddy issues. He was found in uh Henry <laughs> Indy. It's good to see you again. Marcus, what are you doing here? And why are you all dirty? <laughs> Turn the camera, don't ask. <laughs> A running joke. So, Marcus, my old friend, how have you been? Okay. Actually, you see... When, when this game was made, <laughs> that is... You... Cag was going on for me a lot, probably a lot of another 10, 20 years or something, but I feel like there's only recent years you don't hear that phrase as much anymore. Yeah, I mean, I mean more it's a running gag in the show, in the game so far, since at the start, Indy shows up all wet and goes, don't ask. Then Marcus shows up all wet and he goes, don't ask. And now we're again with this. Yeah, okay. I mean, it's, a, it's a gag that yeah. made me... It has is a guy that has been used by many. <laughs> okay, uh, shall we continue from here or try the uh, Zeppelin route? I I honestly say we continue from here because the Zeppelin route looks to be quite lengthy with a uh, three floors of stealth or something. Doesn't get yeah. by the fact that there's three levels <laughs> or three pictures. I think I'd rather take this one since we have gotten this far. Yeah. Let's see. Okay, I'm going to ignore the, I'm going to ignore the guide for the moment to see what we can figure out. So what is out of here? <laughs> Not heading that way. There's a sign. There's the temple. Henry and Marcus. Let's go take a look at this. Let's see, it says. If thou thinkest life is but a game, be warned beyond this point, thou canst, be, you know, canst not be saved. Okay, so no saving past this point. Okay. You saved, right? <laughs> it looks like your standard Grail Temple. Standard Grail Temple. This is the first and only one you've seen, Jones. And yeah, I just saved. There. Ah, wonderful, wonderful. Okay. Can't talk to these two. Can't even look at them. Okay. Let's head to the temple then. Yep. 
Hey, you two. Every moment counts. Yep, this is the place. <laughs> okay. Okay. This is supposed to be a horrifying scene. <laughs> However, the sound effect kind of made it comical. Yeah. First, the breath of God, only the penitent man will pass. Second, the word of God, only in the footsteps of God will he proceed. Third, the path of God, only in the leap from the lion's head will he prove his worth. Okay, from what I remember of the movie, uh, we will need to kneel down here at some point to avoid... Well, we'll see. Yep. Ah, Indiana Jones, you're just in time. Also, the head was not supposed to fly all the way back to the entrance there. It seems I have run out of volunteers. Donovan, Donovan, Donovan. There is nothing, absolutely nothing, that could convince me to get the grail for your purposes. Well, now we have. Except maybe that. I thought you'd see it my way. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that the movie didn't wasn't so uh, blasé about that. The only thing that can save your father now is the healing power of the Grail. I suggest you hurry, Doctor Jones. Junior, remember my diary: the, the three trials. Hang on, Dad. I'll be back as fast as I can. Okay. Only the penitent man will pass. <clears throat> And yeah, the the game basically skips over. Uh, yeah, the the game basically skips over Donovan turning out to be working with the Nazis and such. Let's see. Was it this scene with the? I forgot her name. Or what? Okay, big asses. Yes, she has never been uh, re revealed. <laughs> this is, pre I'm pretty sure, the first you know, part where she shows up as well. Or was but it Donovan in the. You saw her in Venice. Yeah. Or, wait, was, was it Donovan we ran into as we made our way out of the castle? We saw, we saw both Donovan and her. In Venice. Yeah, but that was the but only place the that she showed up, but... Uh, let me actually look back for the guy to see if it was Donovan. Or it was the... The Nazi Captain, Bird, or Vogel. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Okay, so it was Donovan, not uh, Vogel. Vogel we found sound in Castle. Okay, yeah, it was it was Donovan with the machine gun scene where the the diary got taken from us. Okay, now how how do we actually kneel with this? Because there's not really a a command to uh, flying tips, roadblocks, temple. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, first trial is simple, a matter of looking in the grail diary that came with the game, a, a diary with the, that came with the game, and pointing your mouse where the X is on the diagram. Uh, what's that you say? Lost your grail diary? Then just click on the lighter colored piece of dirt next to the big curved rock you might just live for now anyway. Okay, this here. Another one. I'm through. I okay. before they got decapitated there. Let's see. Jehovah, Jehovah. But I believe that starts with an I, actually. Or no. Get back here. <laughs> okay, at least it's quick with loading back. 
I'm pretty sure in the movie it did start with an eye or something. Yeah. Hmm. Damn, I have changed that. They could change that just for this game. Could be. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's see. G E H U. Uh, then was V at you. Okay, so going by the letters, but there's no none of those here. Yep. Hmm. What? Let's see. Okay, apparently here the mistranslation is that it's an O instead of a U. Hmm. Sneaky. Okay. I guess they did this <laughs> on purpose, but they knew that if have someone seen the movie, they'll probably remember the scene and uh, we've gotten that uh, through easily. Wait. Okay. Then this is a bit where the, where the guide is... Uh, wrong then I think yeah because he, he says Jehovah not Jehovah okay hmm okay here we go again with this it is pretty well animated yeah also I'm pretty sure with that role Indy Risk getting cut in half there because he, he starts on one side of the blade but ends up on the other okay Ah, I see. J. V. H. Um. Oh. oh. Hmm. Uh, you. That's supposed to be an N or something. Zehuva. Uh, e is going to break then. Hmm. Okay. There's no image here to show a path, so we will have to find our own. But it looks like, yeah, it looks like up there is the only way forwards here. J A nothing. Let's see. O O. Let's see. Um. There we go. Let me let me. Hmm. What is O's break? So where do we go from here? Oh wait, I see. You. E. Uh, let's see. Oh, I see the path. J. H. E. No, wait. O's break. So not that way. Let's see. <laughs> there. V E like almost there E V E there Okay And let's see mm -hmm. Okay, I remember the... Oh, Indy, hurry up. Your father is getting worse. And no, Marcus, I'm hurrying. Uh, let's see. 
let's see. Da -da 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 -da. Click your mouse over the most protruding rock. Where the big yellow X is on the diagram on the right. Hopefully Indy will make his way safely across the... What? Wait, those over your head? Or those webs? Something here, I think. Let's see. Luckily, I happen to have the help you need to pass the final test. It looks, looks like here you would need to uh, have the physical version as well. Um, it's big. It's the budget version of the Indiana Jones Last Crusade supplies only a cut-down version of the Grail Diary and cunningly manages to miss the drawing that helps you pass this trial. Okay. Uh, that's, mm -hmm. Click your mouse over the center of the most protruding rock on the other side of the gap. Uh, does it mean... Which protruding rock? Hmm... The, the ones. Okay, I'm, I'm just going to. I'm just going to look this up. Yeah, I, I'm gonna suspect we're gonna need a guide for Atlantis one as well, but hopefully not as much as this one. Mm hmm. An image would be useful here. Where to freaking click? Mm. I'm looking for this mostly to try and avoid needing to go over the path again because that was annoying. Land is ready in case we are done with this one early. Mm, yeah. That's lovely. See here. Is this going to actually show where to freaking click? But yeah, we are basically already at the end, 45 minutes in. Uh, roadblocks. Uh, let's see. And yeah, this is the last area. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Okay. Move the cur crosshair to the point of the right ledge that sticks out the most and select it. If all goes well, then it will cross. So... Here? Nope. Okay. Well, here we go again. Uh, oh, right, you cannot save here. Yeah. Oh, Which on one part oh. is a bit fitting, but on the other our part is annoying as hell. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna guess the reason Fate of Atlantis is is beloved is probably due to the probably fixed a lot of the issues they had with this one. Yeah, and it's not a direct movie tie-in either, so it could do a lot more what it wanted to do. Yeah, okay. it's, it's, I think it's a better thing, like, instead of making a, a game based on a specific movie, just make a game with the characters and expand the adventures and universe the characters have. Mm, I think I said in a stream before. And same goes vice versa. If we want to make a series for a game character, maybe don't make the movie based on the very first game they did make the movie based on one of the many adventures instead. 
Okay, there we go. Not too long. Okay, this bit here, maybe? Okay, he basically didn't move an inch to the left or right. Okay. And here we are. <clears throat> I knew you would come. Who are you? I am the last of three brothers who swore an oath to find the Grail unguarded. It was 700 years ago. We were strangely dressed for a knight. But I guess that goes to show that it does work then. Me? I'm no knight. What do you mean? It's no matter. You proved your worthiness by passing the trials. The honor of guarding the Grail is yours. Yeah, about that. Uh, but you don't understand. My father is wounded here in the temple. I've got to find the Grail or he'll die. Very well. I see that your intentions are pure. Choose. Okay, and for this, we need... Uh, to just actually figure out which of these is the actual one. And according to the photo, or to the painting of the Grail, I believe it's supposed to be this one. Uh, oh wait, but... Alright, the game itself may not let you save, but the scum thing, <laughs> the, the engine oh, that it runs through oh, could... <laughs> okay, now... Uh, at least it didn't take that long. Okay, it should be this one, I think. Otherwise, yeah. it would probably be that one. Yeah, I think you, you did screenshot. Yes, I did. I make a, made a photo with my phone to make you know, doubly sure. Okay. Wooden cup carved with holy symbols. Okay. Let's see. We can't talk to the knights. We can't even look at them. Okay, let's have a look at these. Olive wooden cup with silver tray. Dented shallow pewter bowl with engraving. Large ceramic drinking cup. Silver bowl carved with spells of blessing. Brass chalice inscribed in Greek, which would make no sense, I believe, because, uh, yeah. <laughs> it's Italian, not Greek, so that's an obvious fake. Plain metal cup. Ceramic bowl with unknown writing. Plain shallow bronze vessel, pewter chalice with Aramaic inscription. In the movie, it was wooden because uh, in the myths and such, Jesus is supposed to be the son of a carpenter or such. He was a carpenter, I think. Okay, yeah. Then we use the grail. Okay, we can't use it with the holy water. There we go. Okay. I'm gonna make sure this is the right one. Yep. You have chosen wisely. But remember this. The Grail cannot pass beyond the Great Seal. That is the price of immortality. What happened to Donovan? And don't say, don't ask. <laughs> he was so eager to follow you, he just lost his head. <laughs> okay. He was dumb enough to actually go in there. Yeah, they, they really ended up changing a lot here in the end. <laughs> The Grail, it, it even managed to fix his shirt. You did it, Junior. No doubt, you did it. I just followed your diary. And the third brother, still alive? Yes, even after seven centuries. And it does grant immortality. I wonder how he figure it out uh, you know, all these years. My quest is at an end. 
But you found it, son. Its destiny is in your hands now. Marcus, my old friend, I haven't thanked you yet. I wonder how they figured out that you can't pass by the seal with it. Remember the price of immortality. The Grail cannot pass beyond the Great Seal. Else, no. The Grail must remain here. But Inni, the Grail, it can be ours. You heard the knight. It cannot pass beyond the seal. We could act there for a moment. No, I don't believe it. I won't lose it now. Well. And down she goes. Nice going, Elsa. <laughs> okay. I wonder how they figured out that you can't pass by the seal and stay immortal. But I guess what could have happened is that... <clears throat> We found the grave of one of the brothers. Uh, did, or was that the second brother we found? Uh, I'm, I'm blanking on the details, but I'm guessing at least one person uh, who drank from the grail walked past, uh, walked past the seal and basically just disintegrated or something. Okay. And yeah, that, that ended up going a bit different than the movie as well. Oh. Okay, there's the Grail. We could probably try and take it. Hmm. But should we? In the movie, can't. It's too far to reach from here. Oh well. And I guess that's where it stays. I think he'd be picking it up and uh, put it back. No, th yeah, this is just grand. We meet a living veteran of the Crusades, steal his grail, and then completely destroy his temple. All in the name of archaeology? I will never do anything like this again. Cut over to the knight pulling out a broom and just sweeping up the place. Hey, Dad, I think the knight muttered something about his friend Pons, who's living in Florida. <laughs> uh, Pons de Leons. <laughs> Let's go find him. I'm pretty sure they'd never have found anything about Florida ever. Okay, they did pretty good. <laughs> okay. Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade, designed and scripted by Noah Feldstein, Ron Gilbert, and David Fox. Okay, I'm going to look back over the guides here just to see if there was anything we could really do there. <laughs> okay, yeah, of course, if we if we had taken a fake rail, then Indy would have aged to death on the spot after drinking the holy water. Okay. And it would have become unholy water, I guess, by that point. Mm -hmm. Skywalker lunch crew? <laughs> okay, I think it's actually the name of the catering company that they started up. That George Lucas started up, I think. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, I kind of forgot something very iconic of Indy. Oh? The only other item we had in our inventory, the whip. We could have grabbed the grail and brought it back to the night. <laughs> oh! Okay, now it's pretty simple to do that, but... Late now. <laughs> okay. Uh, apparently, if you... If you... <clears throat> yeah, let's see, in order to assure proper recording, you must now bring up the save load screen and select load. This will save your correct series IQ. Okay. 
Not that I... not that we have too much interest on that. But, yeah, if, if we were to grab the uh, trail and try to leave with it, we would just die instead. <laughs> Apparently there's a 50% yeah. chance of getting a humorous ending. Okay. What? Maybe uh, that, that's the one we saw. Uh, let's, uh, um, apparently there is a hmm. Apparently there's a way to keep uh, Elsa alive. How how is that? Let's see. And apparently the maximum amount of IQ points you can get in this game is eight hundred. Holy. Hmm. And we got about four hundred just short. So did pretty well on that. Okay, apparently if we give Elsa the Grail, she'll probably survive. But let's let's do a load back just to see all the other stuff. So there, pick up the correct Grail. Okay, then use with holy water. Okay, I must have misclicked earlier while trying to do that. Yes, but I need to add time. <laughs> okay, we are at about an hour now. <clears throat> okay. But yeah, due to the, due to the limitations of computers and such uh, back in the day, they of course had to change things up. <clears throat> and well, a whole po a whole point of these adventure games is uh, to. <clears throat> Actually, with this, if Donovan ran in after him, shouldn't he have just walked by his corpse? Or is this just a bit of a meta joke that uh, there is no transition of that he doesn't actually pass back through the uh, corridor? <laughs> Maybe? But yeah, let's pick Unless up the grail. The uh, he, they, they say he lost his head, head so his, his head probably came bouncing out. <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to I'm going to put it on a, a bit of a meta joke that he doesn't actually move back through and just transitions back to here directly. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> but yeah, that's the whole. That's the, one of the things with adventure games like these. In if you know what to do, they tend to be pretty short, like a few hours at most. <clears throat> But yeah, most of the most of the playtime with these old games was trying to figure out just what the absolute hell to do in most parts, and just well running into dead ends over and over again. Okay, pick up Grail, and then give Grail to Elsa. Is this going to keep her alive, or no? Elsa, no. Grail must remain here. Mm -hmm. Or are we supposed to give it back to the... Uh... Okay, we're probably supposed to give it back to the knight. Okay, yeah, I, I must have misread that. I think it would make more sense for... Yeah. And there she goes again. You know, it, it would have been pretty hilarious if the thing, if the seal, instead of breaking, actually just spun around. Like... <laughs> like some sort of trap door. But, yeah, that is not how we keep her alive. So, let's load back for our last time. Pick up one of these. And then, and then we will start up uh, Fate of Atlantis, which I feel like we should extend due mm. to this. Yeah, we'd only give it like an hour, so let's not with that. Plus, I do have the family dinner to go to in uh, later. Let's see, Grandmaster okay, Player M 4. Okay, Cap, you are too strong in this game. Please back down now. Don't be like Eminem in the song Won't Back Down featuring Pink. I don't actually know if I know that song. Like, the last I, song I know that uh, Eminem had any part in was, uh... Uh, it was with a... It was with a male rapper, I think. 
Hmm. I haven't heard of them in a damn long time. Which ones? Hmm. In the music video, he was playing a part in a cell or something. Um, I, I'm absolutely blanking on the name of the song, but then again, I, I have not been keeping up with music for, well, with uh, more corporate music, to put it in some way, in quite a long time. Like, I've, I lean, I'm leaning a lot more towards just uh, the indie stuff you can find on YouTube and such. Like Miracle of Sound, JT Music. They often bring out music a lot faster as well. And often of a higher quality, if I'm being honest. Like, maybe it's just because uh, I'm too damn old or something, but I just I just do not like most modern music. Not all. There's still a good few ones every now and then, I'd say. But, like, the majority, I just have no feel for. Yeah, like... Most of the villains are still doing good is like the heavy metal bands and such. But yeah, I've been very neutral to most modern music unless it's from YouTube from a, an independent one or something from a, like Sabaton on, and such. There. I see you indeed have the heart of a true knight. Let's see, Grandmaster Player, did it have 50 cent in the cell with it? If he was, then he was quiet, mm -hmm. because I don't remember him speaking. Your nobility has kept the grail safe and this temple unspoiled. May you find your true path. And off he goes, and he just forgets about the first trap and zip, boing, boing, boing. <laughs> he could have taken the grail from this place. It could have been ours, Indy. That may be your game plan, Elsa, but it won't play that way. I won't play it that way. That was a, just a noble thing you did, Junior. Don't call me Junior. <laughs> what is all this Junior talk? That's his name. Henry Jones Junior. <laughs> I like Indiana. We named the dog Indiana. <laughs> We named you Henry Jr. Come to think of it, my father had a cat named Marcus. <laughs> uh, was it my father's secretary named Elsa? <laughs> Enough, let's go home. <laughs> I think I'll start a Dead Sea Scrolls diary. <laughs> Everybody follow me, I know the way. Uh, uh, Wrong way. <laughs> no, that's not right. <laughs> uh. Okay. Episode and series. Okay, why is there a difference between that, actually? You have better score now! Yeah, because we handed the Grail over, which gives 50 more points or something. Uh, yeah, but yeah. yeah. <laughs> now we can skip through this. Yeah. Okay, skip all of that. And yeah, that'll be it for Indiana Jones and the Last Crusades, the graphic adventure. And yeah, it's it's a big tell that these games lean hell of a lot more towards being a comedy and such, huh? <laughs> yeah. Which I guess for some people would make it a worse story, but th this is mostly for fans with just what if and just uh, the humor of it. Just what if this happened instead and such. It still needs to hit the major beats and such, like uh, the Grail Diary getting stolen, only we get the option to switch it with a fake and just send uh, Donovan on a wild goose chase trying to get all over the place and find where he actually needs to be and such. Uh, but yeah. yeah. Still, that doesn't, uh, yeah, that doesn't detract from the quality of the game itself. Even if, well, if I had played this without a guide, I would have been tearing my hair out from the from the first one. <laughs> okay, and looking at the timer, if we were to start up Fate of Atlantis now, we would have less than an hour of time. Because, of, yeah, typically for the... Actually, no, the dinner, dinner is here, not there, but 
Still, it would only be an hour, so I guess we just have, well, a very, very short stream today. Yeah, and I did try to <laughs> warn you. Okay. Luckily, the well, the game, <laughs> we only had a short part of the game left. Um, let's still go look for someone to raid, though. So let me remove the always on top. Change the screen share over to... Uh... Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, why right now when we need to start the odd game? Yeah, we'd only give it an hour. And I'd rather give it a bit more than just an hour on the first go. Ah, okay, in that way. It... Hmm, I... idea. Hmm? Idea. What would we do as team of the other one of the dinner? Maybe. For We, we hmm. only did one hour now. And we could hmm. do... Yeah, we could do two hours off the dinner. Like, I don't think we're going to go full three hours off the nearest two hour. Then we have three hours in total. Okay, yeah, we could go with that. If nothing gets in the way, of course. <clears throat> uh, let's yes, see. People, I just somehow t <laughs> found a loophole in the system. <laughs> Uh, you put on your adventure game hat and thought of a way to get around it. <laughs> that too. <laughs> no. Let's see. And way, people can, you cannot say, but you only still one hour that day. Did we? Okay, let's see. Wait, wait, why did I just tip an invisible hat towards the screen? <laughs> uh, Anyways, then we have Chubbers the Moon Seal who is streaming Elden Ring, so Walrus with Stardew Valley, Misa and Aleph with Solium Infernum. Can't say I've ever heard of that game. I have! I have! Okay. If I remember, it's like it's a strategy game set in hell. Let me take a peek then. Everything should be muted. Uh, uh, yeah, definitely it, hell. Yeah, Wait, I mean, it, it, is this basically was, civilization, but uh, hell? Yeah, I think it was something, something along that line, but it has some its own mechanics. I think the combat mm. is a bit different. I think. It, it, it basically, yeah, a lot of faction hell trying to conquer hell for themselves. Yeah, okay. Uh, next up, we have Douglas, uh, Douglas, Douglas McDog, who is playing Tomb Raider 123 Remastered. Judging from the title, they are doing a they are doing a challenge run of Tomb Raider 2. No loads, no meds, all secrets. Okay. We have Hus Hisai Rosier playing Home uh, Safety Hotline. Moonrise with Jackbox. K9 with Content Warning. And Kiri Natsuyoko is playing Guild Wars. Okay. And then the last two, we have Profound Badness with Super Robot Tyson Original Generation. Okay, not heard of that either. Let me take a peek. What? Oh, okay. This, this looks like an old uh, PlayStation game. Okay. Which also explains the name. And last but not least, we have Horatius the Dwarf who is just chatting. And according to the title, they're having a recovery day. Okay, sounds like they've had a... <laughs> A bad Saturday as well. Hmm. Let's see. Where is Kiri Natsuyoka with Guild Wars? Ascalon. Okay. Uh, hmm. Oh, I thought I was Alona. <laughs> Alona. I mean, Alona is a desert, not a wasteland. Yeah, so I've, I've, I've mistook, different. <laughs> I mistook this place for a desert. I act Actually, I heard, I think I heard something that uh, Guild Wars got an anniversary update recently or something. Which, honestly, I have to say I'd be very surprised about because the game is like 20, <laughs> at least 20 years old now. And, hmm. Okay, now I'm actually considering maybe streaming you know, the Guild Wars games at some point. Because, well, I did play them a hell of a lot back in the day. I would need to see if I can find my old account, because uh, I, I had two accounts with it, actually. My original one, which for which I lost the passwords, 
and the uh, the email that was on was non-functional or i believe is non-functional and then there's the second one for which yeah i'll, I'll have to take a guess at the pa the password as well so <laughs> i might need to find find an old copy of the game to buy somewhere if need be Ooh, that, that would be a hell of a lot of time um, time lost <clears throat> Yeah. But uh, for now, who would you say to raid? Or shall I take a pick? Uh, hmm. I say Can't... Solarium Imperium. Uh, Solium in Infernum. Oh, I can't Infernum, really yes. say. Can't really say. I'm. I feel too interested in uh, raiding for a Civ-like game. Uh, but if you're sure. Well, as it is, you get to pick there later. Okay, one for one then. So, Misa and Alef, <laughs> copy the name, head to our place. Okay. Uh, oh, <laughs> hello, Pizza. I completely missed you showing up. Sorry about that. Uh, let's see. Pizza, hi, how are you? I came at the end of fucking course. Uh, I have raid suggestion. Oh, by the way, I hit the affiliate, but I'm probably going to be losing that status for a reason I'm not comfortable saying on stream. would rather say it on DMs or something. Okay. Uh, yeah, go ahead and send it in DM then. And affiliate this quickly. That uh, <laughs> I'm pretty sure I've not even hit affiliate or something, so... <laughs> I think we, What's your freaking trick then? Or are I, you maybe confusing I like, something? I feel like we've been close many times. Uh, let's see. I but... think the I think the most I think the most choke pointy thing on that is uh, getting five viewers consistently for quite a bit of time. And yeah, typically we only have like two or three people watching, but oh well. Uh, let's see. I, I hit affiliate in the span of four months of me streaming, and here I here we are at three years. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, do I do f think they have been trying to loosen up uh, the things a little bit? Let's see. Three viewers on average, not five. Okay. I guess we've been edging affiliate for quite a while then. <laughs> but yeah, congrats on that then, Pizza. Yeah, congrats. <clears throat> but yeah. Uh... Uh, just to, just to ask all the same, who would you suggest to raid uh, pizza? Uh, the Nuri I'm now so not going to be, you know, have affiliate for three years. Okay, D did you get bot raided or something and get a bunch of views through that or something? Let's see. They advise Starnak forty eight. Uh, they are, j and I see them here, but I skipped them over because they are just chatting at the moment. With the title being, can I sim for Gabriel or not? No clue who Gabriel is. Uh, okay, so yeah, let's just stick with uh, <clears throat> raiding uh, Misa and Aleph then. Uh, let's see, they were they are playing a game. I don't remember his name. Well, when I looked here, they're looking at Discord or something. So yeah, <laughs> can't really tell what they are playing. So sorry, f sorry for that pizza. Let's see. slash raids paste Misa and Aleph. Yeah, there. When you look over, yeah, I guess he switched games. He's he's streaming his Discord at the moment for some reason. I guess he's just reacting to whatever people are posting there. <clears throat> uh, but yeah, anyways, uh, if, if nothing gets in the way, then after dinner we will start with Indiana Jones and the Fate of Atlantis, which hopefully I will not need as much of a guide for. I'll probably still look one up just in case, but yeah, hopefully uh, won't be as needed. Here's the thing. If you're lucky, I might remember things to help us. Okay. Hopefully. Let's see. It's, uh, it's, uh... Okay, pizza. Well, I'll be back, kind of. I'll be streaming trying to beat the boss in a new game I got. Okay, which game then? I saw you were streaming uh, Watch Dogs Legion for quite a bit. Hmm. <clears throat> But yeah, in the meantime, uh, thank you everyone that's watching now or later. Thank you, Pizza. Thank you, uh, ta -ta -ta, Unlimited Stick and Grandmaster Player. And thank you, any lurkers. Let's see. None with names, according to the OBS chat, but that can be inaccurate. Uh, Lords of the Fallen. Okay. 
Can't remember There's much about that game. There, there are two games with the same name. Okay. Uh, uh, yes, I actually managed to beat Watch Dogs Legion on stream, and I totally did not cry on stream because of the ending. Okay, I've not played any of the Watch Dogs games myself. I do pl I do want to stream 1 and 2 at one point. I've heard that Legion can be a bit iffy, but I'll maybe stream that at some point as well. For the moment, though, we have our list full of the games to stream. Jedi Academy, Republic Commando, maybe Shadow of the Empires... Uh, Shadow of the Empire, followed by, well, the, the Battle for Middle-Earth games. 1, 2, and the expansion, Rise of the Witch King. So we'll probably be busy with that for a while. <clears throat> Ooh. And let's see. Anyway, so thank you as always as well, Drakir. You but as <laughs> always, my friend, and thank you all for watching and joining. Yeah. Uh, Legion is only iffy on the shooting, a bit on parkour, and heavily on driving, and that's it. Okay, story-wise, it's amazing. Okay, so go right and stop delaying. All right, all right. You don't have to chase after me with a pizza cutter. <laughs> but, yeah. Uh, let's get the debate started, yeah? And, yeah, thank you all again for watching, and until next time, have a nice day, and until then. Be safe, everyone, and watch out for undead seagulls. And, uh... Your fake grails.